It's the season finale below deck. Dry land, damp eyes, and man, everyone's a mess. Cat refuses to get up and work. Obviously, everyone's upset about that. Um, Kate was like really nice about it, which is kind of hypocritical because she is all over Amy for like everything. And then she's like, oh, Cat's just not going to work. And Cat's just awful. Like she gets up and she's like, eh, my crew's all mad. I don't really care. And, you know, she, like, hooked up with Ben, and then she's, like, talking about her boyfriend all the time. And I'm like, he's going to watch the show, right? Like, isn't that going to be super awkward? And Kelly's a total weasel because he spent all season just chasing Janice hard. Like, hard, hard, hard. And then all of a sudden he pulls out with this, well, I really need to focus on me thing. That's fine, dude, but don't lie. Like, if you are going to go after Janice the way he went after Janice, and be honest and be like, I'm just really horny and I find you attractive and let's just hook up and have a nice time. Don't be like, oh, I need you near me. I want to be with you. You're just so awesome. You're the kind of person I get. And then turn around and be like, you know what I mean? Like, I just am super, like, ugh. So I feel awful for her because it's not like she misread his signals. Like, this is clearly what he was telling. He was, like, flat out saying this to her. And then he's like, oh, I just want to be, I just, I just want to, uh, you know, focus on me. And I'm like, dude. And I'm kind of mad at Amy, too, because she's like, he's a great guy, and you're going to really regret passing him up. Um, pretty sure she doesn't feel that way anymore. Right? And, uh, anyway... A lot of you on Twitter, at least, hate Kate. I just can't hate her. I just I just find her delightful. I understand why people dislike her. I agree that maybe she's not the best coworker. I just I just I just don't dislike her. I, I guess everybody needs friends and I would be friends with her. Unless she pulled that on me, then I'd be all Anyway, there, um, the big, you know, towel gate, you know, with the penis and all. That guest comes back with all men. It looks like a super fun charter. It's definitely, I'm glad they ended on that note because it was nice to actually see things go the way they're supposed to and not have everyone complain the whole time. Kate does apologize to Amy. They seem to have gotten it worked out. There's this whole big thing with dinner service. Um, I get Ben's point. I get Kate's point. Um... Anyway, they get through, end of charter, Captain Lee gives them all pacifiers because they are acting like whiny babies for doing their job. And then Kelly's like, see ya, and takes off. And I feel so bad for her because even though I gave her a hard time about giving out some mixed signals, she at least felt the way as a signal she was giving out, whereas he just totally was just kind of a slime ball about the whole thing. Like basically, well, I mean, it's not basically he lied, he lied. He said one thing and then was like, whoa, that's not even close to what I want. You know, I know I said I wanted to be with you and thought you were awesome and I could see being with you, but uh, I don't. You know what I mean? Anyway, I guess they've already been renewed for season three. I'll be interested to see who returns. My opinion, Kate and I should have a spinoff show. So she should move up here to the mountains. You know, a nice like uh, we can hit one of these nice ski towns and we can be housewives. I'll help, I'll help her date, you know, we'll do, well, that's my opinion. I don't think I get a vote, but that's my opinion. See you guys soon.